So welcome back, we're on the scar find now. And the aim today is just to thin out this water a bit. So yeah, just a couple of passes. Not going too deep, just tickling the surface of the soil. First pass, nice and quick. If I hadn't have scalped this beforehand in my previous video, if you saw that one, this would have been a nightmare to scarify. Uh, if you ever do want to reset your lawn, highly recommend scalping it first, taking all the meat off. So here we can see we've gone probably about a centimetre deep in places. This is very uneven, which is a bit annoying. So it's uh, obviously not very very accurate and like this little bit this little section down here there's like a little bit of a dip all the way down here so the scarifier doesn't touch so yeah I'm gonna do another another scarifying pass horizontally now and then that should be it
So yeah, that should do it. And again, any low spots, the scarifier doesn't really get into it. But yeah, what you're trying to get rid of is all this, all this fluffy crap. You want to sort of uh, try and break that down. So I say the level, the level of the surface, the easier it is. This is bumpy as hell, which is a, a bit of a pain to be consistent. Yeah, again, it's probably gone a little bit too deep in a few places where it's raised up. I'd rather go aggressive on it at this time of year because this will uh, bounce back pretty nicely. And look at the waste. There's hardly any waste. If I'd have scarified this before scalping it, it would have been a completely different job. The scarifier would have struggled. There would have been just masses of stuff. I always recommend scalping first if you're resetting your lawn. It just makes it easier. Because all I need to do now is run over with my mower and bag this up. And uh, job done. So a scarifying done. Got a few bare bits. It's still a little bit wet. So uh, the mower was churning it up a little bit. So yeah, that filled half a bag, all of that, the scarifying in the final scalp. And it was a lot easier on the body. I didn't have to get my leaf blower out or rake out to clear up all the stuff. I pretty much did, did all the work with my mower. Preferred method anyway, where I can. Obviously not every lawn you'll be able to do that. Yeah, and you do need a pretty good mower to be honest to be able to do a good scalp. A lot of mowers don't even cut low enough half the time. But I'd certainly be inclined to uh, take your lawn shorter anyway. That would be my advice. Shorter than you uh, want. If you're scarifying, it means your lawn's probably not in the best condition anyway. So yeah, it's better to start with a clean slate, in my opinion. And yeah, you can see we've got a checkerboard effect here. I like that style of leaving little squares. Sprayed a bit of wake up juice on it just to help it along. Hit a thumbs up if you enjoyed that. Uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers!